Good afternoon, Gages Lake. I hope you're having a great Wednesday. Tomorrow is Thanksgiving, and uh, whatever your plans might be for your family, I hope that uh, for my wife and family, we wish each of you a wonderful Thanksgiving and uh, this time of year. Uh, we've been Cheyenne so excited. Christmas is one of her favorite times of year, and mine too. So uh, I hope that you're looking forward to the next few weeks' holidays. And so um, just wanted to give you an update. Hopefully you got the chance to... Uh, enjoy your little treat uh, that came uh, the last couple of days as we uh, weren't able to meet together for our pie and pray service, but we wanted to still uh, share in some pie. So I uh, hope you enjoyed those and a special treat uh, as our, I'm so thankful, I'm so thankful for the, the those who are involved in, in uh, taking care of delivering them. Um, we, we have great people at our church and uh, I'm, I'm happy you were, some of you were able to see one another and uh, just to make contact again. It's some For some, it's been a while. So uh, I wanted to share that uh, if you haven't done so, we're looking for you to uh, uh, send in your videos. Uh, once again, we did this back in the spring, uh, but we'd love to do it again for the holidays. So uh, I would love for you to send us a Christmas greeting or a, a happy holidays or something with you and your family or uh, a picture if you would prefer to do that, but uh, we'd love to compile those together and then share them uh, to the church family so that way we can stay connected with one another. Uh, if you could get those to us uh, in the next week or so, so that way we can get them all together uh, in time for Christmas, uh, that would be so much appreciated. So uh, send them in. They could be goofy. They could be fun. It's really, this is our church family, and this just gives us a chance to uh, see one another again and say hi to everybody. So uh, send in your videos or pictures. Uh, you can email them to me, uh, jlovelace79 at gmail.com. Uh, so that way we can compile them together. Uh, and then I have the ability on my computer to format them. So just send in the video links. If it's too big, uh, I think you can share it through a Google Drive. Uh, that If you have an email address, you should be able to do that. So uh, if you have questions about it or you're unable to get it shared that way, Please let me know as well, and I can get a, I uh, can get a uh, something over. We can get it copied somehow. So, uh, but send those in in the next uh, the next week or so, so that way we can we can get those put together. So, um, uh, this this week is a is an interesting week. Yesterday we had uh, a little bit of snow uh, in the morning, you know, and on the way I already have my older kids who told me. Oh, I don't like snow. Why don't you like snow? It just means we have to shovel it. I'm like, well, you know, it's part of growing up. So anyway, uh, no, as we are looking forward to uh, the next few days with Thanksgiving, there's a psalm that you're all familiar with. I just want to read it to you. Uh, psalm 100 uh, says, Make a joyful noise to the Lord, all the earth. Serve the Lord with gladness. Come into his presence with singing. Know that the Lord, he is God. It is he who made us, and we are his. We are his people, the sheep of his pasture. Enter his gates with thanksgiving and his courts with praise. Give thanks to him. Bless his name. For the Lord is good. His steadfast love endures forever. And his faithfulness to all generations. Can you say amen to that? To know that God is good to sing praise to the Lord that we know he is God. He has made us. We are his people. We are the sheep of his pasture. And so these next few days, as you spend time with perhaps family or friends, or maybe just you or just a couple of people, uh, can, you, can you worship him? Can you say, thank you, God, for giving me life, for giving me breath, for giving me this beautiful relationship that I have with you? Uh, to enter his gates with thanksgiving and I and his courts with praise and I think of I think of uh, every year my uh, my mom loved watching the Macy's Thanksgiving Day Parade you know like the big balloons and as kids you'd wanted to see the balloons and they would do the performances the bands and orc walking uh, uh, walking band marching bands and uh, they would have dance routine they would just have this this humongous parade. Every year, the Macy's uh, Thanksgiving Day Parade, and I heard this year it's going to be virtual, and it's like, oh, well, you know, one more thing. When I think of enter his gates with Thanksgiving and enter his courts with praise, I think of that. I think of like this 
this huge fanfare of of just praising and thanking God and and for me that's that's that moment when we set foot into heaven I think we don't we can't even imagine what the 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 glory that is going to be causing us to just praise God and to thank God that um when you read over in Revelation, it talks about the multitudes of every nation, of every kin, tribe, and tongue, and this 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 mass of people who are just in all in unison, just praising God and glorifying God, and and I think, wow, what to be a part of that, to just be a voice, just one, but our voice connected with the multitudes of of Christians from all time. Praising our God because he alone deserves it. He alone. Know that the Lord, he is God. And when I think about that, boy, it causes me to have such joy now. It causes me to have such such uh, a thankful heart now. And and to to show my kids, God, I, kids, I want you to see God. I want you to see Christ. I want you to be in that one day, that multitude of people uh, praising him. And so as you go into Thanksgiving these next few days and uh, tomorrow and then the weekend, can you, can you praise him? Can you thank him? Uh, serve the Lord with gladness. Uh, when, we, when we talked about doing the, the pie deliveries uh, for all of our people, Cheyenne reached out to our small group. Uh, we've been meeting kind of uh, together. The women meet one week, the men meet one week. And uh, so she reached out to our small group and she goes, hey, listen, this is what Jay and I had an idea to do is to send out pies to, to everyone. And it's a lot of people. If it's one person, what do you guys think? And she said she was amazed at how, how quickly and how glad people were to serve. And I know that, that we have such great people, not, to, not just in our small group. We have great people in our church who faithfully serve, who, who want to minister to one another and, and they do it with gladness. And so can, can I encourage you to keep that going, to serve the Lord with gladness, um, to, to praise him, to come into his presence with singing, and then let us always remember, as the last verse says, verse 5, for his steadfast love endures forever. Steadfast love is that word that also can be translated mercy, also can be translated propitiate. Like there's that whole uh, message of the gospel. Like his love that is steadfast, that there's nothing that separates you from the love of God. There's, there's his mercy is renewed every morning. He is faithful. Let's worship him. Let's worship him today. Let's worship him tomorrow, Thanksgiving day. Let's worship him every day. And let's continually praise God with our lips, with our thoughts, with our actions. I hope each one of you has a great Thanksgiving. My wife and I love each one of you and, and miss you. Uh, we look forward to the day when we can continue to just meet without masks or any kind of mitigations, but uh, we know that, that God is in control. Uh, thank you for your feedback. Some of you gave feedback for your uh, videos, uh, for the uh, uh, issue, uh, the, the online streaming, and we're working on it. We've got, we've got some ideas of trying to get this fixed. We want to do this the right way and uh, just continue that on because we don't know how long we'll be able to or how long we'll be needing to do this. So you pray for the tech team as they are uh, working hard to fix any of the issues that we have. So, uh, But thank you so much uh, for, for continuing to worship with us. Uh, thank you for your wonderful kind words and feedback and things. And God is so good. God is so good. Uh, I wish each one of you a happy Thanksgiving. We will see you next week as we Turn our attention uh, next week uh, in our Wednesday in the Word. We're going to start looking at Christmas a little bit. So uh, have a great week, everyone, and uh, we'll see you next week.